London, Victoria Alvarez is a ball of energy, darting around the Seven Sisters indoor market in North London. On a recent morning, she broke away from chatting with a friend to burst into a general store in the market, asking its Iranian owner if he had some supplies she needed. She barely had time to hear his response before she was off again, standing behind the counter at her currency exchange and parcel shipping stall. In a brief quiet spell, when her husband took over, Alvarez walked across the hall to one of the market's hairdressers for a blow dry. For Alvarez, a Colombian native who has had a stall here for 16 years and is president of the Traders Association, the market is a second home. Customers can shop for groceries, get a bite to eat or a haircut, meet a real estate agent and get legal advice, all under one roof. Her daughter spent much of her youth in its hallways. To me, my roots are very important, she said. This is why this market is such an important part of the community. Now, she says Seven Sisters Indoor Market, the biggest Latin American market in England, by its estimation, is under threat, caught in one of London's largest ever redevelopment programs. Traders say that they are being priced out, that local officials are riding roughshod over their complaints, and that a hub for the British capital's Spanish-speaking minority will be lost. The district surrounding the market, 